Imagine a world where trees talk to each other, sharing secrets beneath the soil. This isn't a fantasy realm or a science fiction novel. This is the reality of our Earth's forests, where an intricate network of mycorrhizal fungi weaves a web of communication and cooperation beneath our feet. This network, often called the Wood Wide Web, is the lifeline of a forest. The mycorrhizal fungi form a symbiotic relationship with trees, connecting their roots and facilitating the exchange of nutrients and information. It's a subterranean social network where trees share resources, warn each other of danger, and even support their weaker companions. But the conversation isn't just below ground. Above the soil, trees communicate using chemical signals. When under threat, for instance from a pest invasion, trees can release pheromones into the air. Their neighbors detect these signals and respond, often by producing bitter tannins to deter the pests. In the heart of this forest community, you'll find the mother trees. These are the largest, oldest trees that serve as hubs in the network. They're like the wise elders of the forest, nurturing young saplings by sharing nutrients and knowledge. Understanding these complex communication networks isn't just fascinating, it's crucial for conservation. To protect our forests and their biodiversity, we must preserve these networks. Recent scientific studies and conservation projects are focusing on this, particularly aiming to protect old-growth forests with their intricate mature networks. The science behind this mystery is still evolving. Scientists use methods like isotopic tracing and controlled experiments to uncover the secrets of tree communication, but there's still much to learn and many challenges to overcome. The forest is more than just a collection of trees. It's a community, a network, a living, breathing organism. It's a testament to the wonder and complexity of our natural world, a reminder of the interconnectedness of all life. We must remember that our actions have far-reaching effects on these delicate balances. So as we tread lightly in the forest, let's marvel at the conversation happening beneath our feet. And perhaps let's listen a little closer. Maybe the trees have something to tell us. We would love to hear your thoughts or experiences related to forests and conservation. And if there's a nature or science topic you're curious about, we're all ears. Because the more we understand about our world, the better we can protect it.